Okie dokie. What's up everybody? Here we have a 2009 Advent laptop computer. And this thing has been an absolute tank. There has been nothing wrong with it, touch wood. And the computer, the only thing that I could pick with it, so to speak, is how fast this machine runs. It's not the quickest thing in the world, but it does get up to speed eventually. I mean, I've had this thing for what? Brought in January of 2009, so I've had it four years now. And there's been no viruses, no issues, no nothing. Apart from the batteries going flat rather quickly. It only lasts about five minutes and that's it. But I've seen on Amazon you can buy replacement batteries for these, which is good news. Because I would like to use this computer when I'm like doing things like private jobs and whatnot, but that's in the future. I'm hopefully going to upgrade this soon to a, well, I'm going to keep the same laptop then upgrade it. Just put Windows 7 in there, uh, some more RAM, because what it's got in there at the moment is not good for Windows Vista at all. Well, uh, somewhere on this computer, there is a certificate but on all laptops the certificate oops the certificate wears out and this one has unfortunately wear, worn out now this thing has been sitting on many laps and many beds and all I can say is it gets hot and obviously laptops do get hot Anyway, it's a laptop, it's an Advent, uh, where is it? model 5612 and uh, Intel Core Celeron, Intel Celeron Dual Core T1600 processor at 1.66 gigahertz. It's got a 2.4 gigabyte RAM or 2 gig RAM it's got 160 gigabyte hard drive uh, lithium ion battery uh, rewrite, DVD rewritable um, uh, where is it? little DVD rewritable uh, drive it's also got 15.4 inch widescreen monitor built in a Windows Vista Home Premium system and that's it uh, it did come with Cyberlink and that is what I was actually using to record my first ever videos it was on this little camcorder built into this laptop um, it's, it's since the quality has become absolutely shit I can't use it the only way I can use it is for Skype and that's just about it. Uh, here's a little battery. So I'm going to move it before we go. And uh, this battery is 11.1 volts DC at 3700 milliamp hours. And it just pops in there like that. Here we have the charger. And it's a... I can't even pronounce the really thing. Lai Sin Shine International Enterprise Corporation AC adapter. Now it's a model something something something. I can't read Chinese or Japanese or whatever it is. Uh, it's a 0335C2065. Uh, input is Zero, uh, 100 volts to 240 volts, 50 to 60 hertz, or 1.7 amps. And the output is 20 volts, I should imagine DC, two, well, 3.25 amps continuous rating, I think. Now, hopefully this is the same original plug, yes it is. This plug, well this charger, when I used to plug it into extension leads, did arc quite a lot. 
hence why that pin there is rather black and the same can be said with that one it's a little bit char grilled so to speak that's because silly me plugs this in to the laptop first and then plugs it in it should be the other way around plug it into the mains then plug it into the laptop because there was such a load on this on the uh, socket it was shocking it really it was just arcing because the, amp the amperage was quite high for some reason don't know why anyway um this computer is quite cool because it's got a touchscreen for mail, Wi-Fi and internet. And the only other thing I can pick with this computer is when you're typing, I like to type like that and sometimes I touch the mouse, like this keypad, and the, ma the uh, writing or the mouse will shoot off to the other side of the screen. Well, I guess I'm on my nerves. Other than that, it is showing its age. It is showing its age because this little laptop support thing, this side bit here is missing, it's broken away and the only other thing holding this side of the screen in is this bit here, which is a bit of a shame. Anyway, uh, it's not been used for about a week, maybe two weeks, because we've been busy and family get issues and whatnot, so here we go. That's the power supply making that noise. It's alive. And it should be alive. Hey, there we go. Yeah, like I said, this thing will be slow. Windows Vista. It's alive. And there we go. Let's have a little look around. Okie dokie. So this thing has got a Surface Pack 2 uh, Windows Vista Home Premium. This has got a genuine Intel R CPU 21600 at 1.66GHz 2GB RAM and a 32-bit operating system. And I'll be doing a few things on this computer anyway because there's a few things which need to be uninstalled and deleted and yada 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 okie dokie well 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 it's been on for about 20 minutes to near enough 25 minutes and yeah it's running all right now so we shut it down and it decides to shut down Anything. There we go. Yeah, I mean, this thing is quite slow. So I've had enough time to set it to do a few tasks, had enough time to put a wash on, have a cup of coffee, have some breakfast, and then it's still doing it. Says you how slow it is. Anyway, thanks for watching folks.